and a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one, my goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Juventus against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Starting lineup for Juventus. Wojciech Szczesny begins in goal. Paul Pogba plays alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Presnel Kimpembe plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar out wide. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Alexandro, Locatelli, Kostic. Locatelli. They've won back possession. Verratti. Mbappe. On to Neymar. Verratti! An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, let's look at this again. And the keeper just lost his bearings there. He was never in the right position. He won't want to see that again. And so back playing again, PSG with the lead. Locatelli, Kostic has it. Vlahovic. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. And the keeper there to deal with it. Vlaovic. And just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. Pereira. That's how to dispossess your opponent. Messi. Well, a top notch piece of defensive judgment. And Juventus will get the throw in.
to attack from the wide areas. Locatelli. And teammates to play it to. Verratti. Mbappe. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Dusan Vlahovic. Pogba. Bonucci. And return to Pogba. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Hakimi. How can he take them on and beat them? A fine reading of the situation. Kostic. Vlaovic. Just not looking confident in possession. Marco Verratti. Paul Pogba's incisive pass. Vigorous defending. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. He landed really heavily on his shoulder there. You can see the discomfort he's in. But he's a tough guy. I think he'll carry on. Cheers, Jeff. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Messi. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. PSG, as you can see, have not enjoyed that much possession. But that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. And still danger here. But no, that's the end of the move because offside is the verdict. Vlahovic. Bonucci. And nicely cut out. And giving the ball away. Now Paul Pogba. Oh, a goal! They've taken full advantage of a dreadful mistake by the goalkeeper. Well, here's the replay, and as you can see, he doesn't read the danger at all, does he? It's a poor piece of goalkeeping. So back on the way, one goal apiece here. Paredes. Di Maria. And the problem not completely solved. PSG doing well to regain possession. Plenty of support here. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Vlaovic. On to Messi. Kylian Mbappe. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. In possession to give them the lead, maybe.
Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And from that sort of range, you'd be shocked if Mbappe missed out. He just keeps showing us what a top finisher he is. And with that, the first half comes to an end here in Turin. Well, who wouldn't want to have Kylian Mbappe in their side? Stewart, a key component. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Committed challenge. Di Maria. And continues his run. And Neymar. Messi. Well, it really wasn't a great effort, was it? Quadrado is with Paredes. Locatelli. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Pogba. Here's Quadrado. Di Maria. And it goes! Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Ferreira. Now with Messi. Well, it could be on for him here. Quadrado. Pogba has it. Di Maria. Vlaovic. Can they forge ahead? Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Thirty minutes to go then. Well, attacking possibilities. Keeper did his job to begin with, and he clears it out of harm's way. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Well, PSG will count themselves unlucky not to have taken the lead there, but that was a great bit of goalkeeping. What a save that was. Playing with plenty of zest and energy on the front foot once more. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. It's a substitution for Juventus. Well, they're going for the short one. And a chance for them to notch in front. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Vlahovic, Kostic, the Bianconeri have given us away, Neymar, Danilo, Di Maria now, Dusan Vlahovic, Chance to run at them. And the snuffing out of the cross there.
Kimpembe. Neymar. Lionel Messi. Mbappe with it. Will take it away. He won the ball. Locatelli. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Minch. Here's Renato Sanchez. Mbappe. Beautiful pass. And he read it well defensively. This might be ideal for the counter. Di Maria must take the lead here. And not cleared away properly. Right over for now, it seems. Just ten minutes remaining here. Progressive football from Paris Saint-Germain. They know a goal at this late stage might be decisive. And fine goalkeeping. And the Juventus personnel change here. Keen to take it short here. No luck for Neymar in the passing department. Paul Pogba. Juventus have given it away. Can Juventus create one more big chance to win this game? If they do, this stadium will erupt because these fans have been brilliant here today. And Juventus getting forward. A goal at this late stage and that might be that. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. A Panenka penalty and a brilliant goal. Well, some people might have had doubts about his run up, but the referee didn't see anything wrong. He had to score, and he does. And he steps up to take the shot. And just like that, he's come up with the save. And he scores. And he steps up to take his penalty. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And he's beaten the keeper. So much pressure. If he fails to score, they lose. And confidently converted. Well, this could be the one. In it goes. That seals it. Well, under pressure, that's a very composed penalty. And over the course of the game, they just about deserved it.